what we do here is go back, 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 back. Hey guys, welcome back to our channel. So today I'm making an after school snack for my kids. Today we're having ham and cheese sliders. Okay, so to make my sliders I use Fiesta cheese, black forest ham, but buttered syrup, parsley, I'm going to use some garlic and onion powder, the Hawaiian sweet rolls itself, and I'm going to have some butter to mix with my syrup to make a sweet topping. Okay, so let's get started. All right, and that's my oven, and it has already reached its temperature of 400 degrees. So I'm gonna take my hand, place it on top of the bread so that I can hold it. And I'm using a serrated knife to cut my loaf in half. you take your hand press them in okay so first thing I'm going to be doing is opening up my black horse ham okay. I'm going to be very generous with the meat because I know my kids get hungry and I'm sure yours does, yours does too when they get out when they get out of school it onto a baking sheet and I'm gonna work on my mixture my sweet mix I thought I'd come up with a name for this little concoction that I make for my kids because they seem to enjoy it okay so I have one stick of butter in here going to add syrup. I do not measure. I stop whenever I feel like stopping. Okay, so that's all I'm going to use. I'm going to go ahead and grab a spoon. Give that a stir. I brush it onto my buns. 
it'll go ahead and fall in place. But that's how my mixture looks. Okay. So I'm gonna go ahead and brush this on. to be nice and sticky on top and sweet and then it's going to be a little salty in the middle with the cheese and I give this a, a brush on all sides even the, uh, if I swipe the ham and cheese that's okay I usually do poppy seeds and parsley as well, but I do not have any parsley seeds. So I'm going to use the parsley and the garlic and onion. And you guys, this is pizza spice by the way. But since they have a variety of things in the jar, I like using this. This is also garlic and cheese. Doesn't that look like an amazing snack? I'm pouring on a little bit more syrup. Okay. So, I am now going to stick this in my oven for about 15 minutes and while it's baking I'll work on something else see you back here in a few hi guys and welcome back so now I'm gonna take my ham and cheese sliders out of the oven and guess what my kids just popped in hi guys Hello. so I'm gonna take my ham and cheese sliders out of the oven and I'm gonna slice these up so that they could take part in having a snack all right Hey, baby girl. Hey, boy. Hello, Mom. Can I How are you, you doing? I'm, I'm doing fine. All right. So, I'm going to go ahead and take my knife. Slice these up. Okay. Go ahead and put your book bags down. Okay. By the time you guys come back, I'll have your snack ready. Okay. All right. All right. I'm going to take this pot holder here and hold the pan. Get our sandwiches off. All right. Let's get those three off. Say hi, everybody. Hi, everybody. All right. That's my little girl. That's Navea. Hello. She had to stick her hands in front of the camera. All right. So I'm going to go come across the opposite side and cut another three. Hold on, baby boy. Okay. All right. So I'm going to keep slicing here and I'm going to pull one off. Okay. The other rest I'm going to set aside because my oldest is coming home soon. And that way she can have a snack as well. I hope you're going to be okay. So, I'm going to ask you guys to step back a little bit so that I can get this stuff done. I'm going to put two here for Navea. And I'm going to stick two here for Emmanuel. Alright, you guys, come around the other side and come get your tray. Thank you. All right. That ends our video. 
with our ham and cheese slider snacks for kids after school. So please stay tuned and come on back to join Team McClary.